We are going to take a look at automation solutions from small to large from the Homark Group. Werner Brinkhaus is with me. You're the head of product management at Weke. What is this machine here? What we can see here is a combination of a typical CNC processing center with a linear feeder. The CNC can be a three-axis, four-axis or five-axis machine with what is known as a linear feeder. With this linear feeder we can talk of an overall semi-automatic system. That means that on the one hand we have a processing center that I manually feed from the front for batch size 1 components. That is also the reason that the feeder has been fitted on the side. The feeder itself is brilliantly suited to series components, large and small series as well as for heavy parts that have to be lifted. And what is typical, and that is always the best thing, is that after work, if you have an hour's time, you can start up the machine again and the machine actually works fully automatically for another hour. Thank you for that information, Mr. Brinkhaus. So that is the classic entry-level solution. Because there is so much to talk about with the cells for larger solutions, I have found two people to talk to. Christian Heisler from Homark Automation, and here is Eduard Schiesel from Homark. Large automation solutions. Who is this concept behind us suited to and what components is it made up of? Well, the concept is made up of two main components. On the one hand we have the CNC machine from the BMG series, and the automation device is a robot from Homag Automation as you can see on the right hand side. The robot is always to the side and loads and unloads the machine from the side. We made the concept universally applicable. You can make doors just as well as tabletops with it. So it's of interest to furniture manufacturers, a very broad spectrum. We will also see various parts at the trade fair. Essentially, we are one step further on the product path. So we have more to offer, more functions, and we are more flexible compared to the little brother TBA. Mr. Heisler, how exactly does this machine behind us work? The robot identifies the workpiece in the raw part stack. The workpiece is picked up, is separated from the robot and placed on the aligning table. The length, breadth and thickness of the workpiece is validated against the data set again on the aligning table. So a plausibility check is carried out. The robot takes the workpiece from the aligning table and places it precisely on the BMG machine. Processing then takes place on the BMG machine and in the meantime, during processing, the robot takes the next raw part and places it on the aligning table. That means the workpiece turnaround is incredibly fast. Mr. Schiesel, I just want to mention three things. Performance, function and flexibility. Yes, well, performance is improved because the robot is quicker and we are about twice as quick as the TBA. We have a device with very high availability. It is industry standard in the automotive sector. That means we can use the system faster and more frequently. In combination with the aligning table, we can also use the downtime productively. That means that while the machine is working here, something else is happening there. That's performance. That's flexibility. We have a six-axis robot. It has a spherical working area. You can expand your functions and it is a safe investment because you can use the robot on a different system at a later date. And point three, more functions. We can work with a stacking list or scan barcodes. We can rotate or not. And we have a plausibility check on the aligning table, which I think is very important. That is key to true batch size 1 production. If every part is different, it is important to know how big the parts are. Thank you very much. Automation solutions for traditional craftsmen to large industrial operations. All available from Homark.